Hello, in this video tutorial, we're going to show you how to connect your Zoho inventory account to EasyShip. With EasyShip, you instantly gain access to over 250 discounted shipping solutions. And if you have your own courier account, no problem, you can directly link them as well to use your own rates. The EasyShip Zoho inventory app allows you to directly sync from your Zoho account or from your EasyShip account. It works both ways. Through the EasyShip dashboard, you can automatically generate your customs documentation and international paperwork with tax and duty costs fully landed. Those are just a couple features Zoho merchants gain access to via the EasyShip integration. Now let's spend some time going through the onboarding flow for new Zoho inventory merchants. Integrating with EasyShip from your Zoho account can be done in a few quick steps. From the integration page, you'll scroll down to Shipping Integrations, where you'll find EasyShip. Click on our icon to get started. Once you land on the page, simply click Accept, and you'll be directed to the EasyShip app where you can log into your account or sign up for a new EasyShip account. From the sign up page, you'll enter your email address, company name, and address. Then you'll select the default category of your products, and importantly, the dimensions of your shipping boxes and the default weight. This is important for getting accurate shipping quotes. On your home screen, you'll be able to see your analytics dashboard, which gives you an overview of where your shipments are. You can also use our get a quote feature to get estimates on your shipping costs. Create shipments is where you'll be able to sync all your orders in one click. In manage shipments, you'll be able to see the status of all your shipping labels. The first important step is to sync the products from your Zoho store with EasyShip. Click on Product Listings, and then Add Products. Choose your organization, which will be Zoho, and then click on Sync, and your products will be listed in EasyShip. It's important to store your product details in EasyShip to make sure you generate the most accurate shipping costs. It's a small detail, but very important. Orders on Zoho are called packages. To sync them to EasyShip, you'll go to Create Shipment, then select Advance. From Add Shipment, you'll select your organization, which will be Zoho. This will sync your current packages into EasyShip, where you can now edit them. From here, you can edit your shipment, including the order details and the receiver information. Under Edit Courier, you'll be able to compare pre-negotiated rates between couriers to ensure you're selecting the best option for your customers. And as you can see in the banner, you can link to your own courier account and rates through the courier settings. To start shipping, select the order by checking it, and then click Ship in the upper right hand corner. Here is where you'll buy the shipping label. You also have the choice to purchase shipping insurance and choose your drop-off location. If you have it set up, you can also choose to have the package picked up from your store location. Next, you'll confirm the order. From here, you can print all your shipping documents, including your labels. You'll need to make sure you have a proper label printer connected in order to print them. Back on your Zoho account, you'll see the package is now listed under Shipped Packages. EasyShip syncs and takes care of the fulfillment for you. With tracking, you can see that the package will show in transit on the EasyShip dashboard. If you go to your Zoho account, you'll see it sync as well, showing you date, location, and time for the status of your package. When the shipment is delivered, you'll see the status change to delivered. Jump back to your Zoho dashboard and presto, you'll see the package as delivered as well. If you need to cancel a shipment, you can do so by clicking the three little dots on the right which will bring up this shipment. Then press the red cancel shipment button. Confirm. And then back on Zoho, you'll see that the shipment is now back in the packages, not shipped column. Those are just a few of the features you'll have access to when you integrate your Zoho inventory account with EasyShip. For more tips and tutorials, visit the EasyShip blog and follow us on our social media channels. Happy shipping.